what is going on guys welcome back to a brand new video and today we are on or not unboxing sorry about that we are doing a wwe wrestlemania 39 predictions video we are sorry i choked a little um uh we're doing everything that i think everything my dad thinks i've got it memorized uh let's go i can't wait we got the preview show thing pre-show up there and yeah let's get into it First off, first match of the night is going to be John Cena in his return match against Austin Theory for the United States Championship. That belt right there. I have, oh, there it is. There's the the little match card for it. It's going to be, I have John Cena to pick up the victory on this, on Austin Theory. And uh, new champ for a little while and then like he loses it on raw the next night or something you know or you know what i'm talking about two nights from now but yeah i have new champion john cena right there um let's go dominic mysterio versus Rey mysterio i have Rey mysterio picking up the victory on dominic mysterio yes it might be Rey's last wrestlemania but you gotta have him winning in this last WrestleMania if it was his last WrestleMania. And, uh, but yeah, Logan Paul versus Seth freaking Rollins. There's the custom Logan that my best friend, uh, made. He also has a, a YouTube channel. It's called, like, Universe of Figures. Um, but, uh, this is just Kenny Omega. In this, me and my dad have Logan Paul to pick up the victory. On Seth Rollins. I forgot to tell y'all. Uh, my dad has Dominic Mysterio to beat Rey Mysterio. And he also has uh, Austin Theory to win over uh, John Cena. But to my predictions John Cena, Rey Mysterio, Logan Paul, and his is also Logan Paul. Um, Next match I'm going to get into is going to be Braun Strowman and Ricochet versus Alpha Academy versus Street Profits versus the Viking Raiders. I'm not sure what this really is for, but um, I have Braun Strowman and Ricochet or the Alpha Academy to pick up the victory. Uh, one of the two, Alpha Academy need to be pushed a little bit, but I love the team of Braun Strowman and Ricochet. Also, and my dad has the Street Profits to win, which would be a good choice. I think that that that's good. I, I like that choice because what if Montez Ford turns on Angelo tonight? You know, like, that's sick if that would have happened. And then Montez gets boots up to a title shot or something against Cody and stuff like that. Next match I'm going into... Um, is Becky Lynch, uh, Lita, and Trish Stratus versus Damage Control, Io Sky, Dakota Kai, and Bailey? Um, I have Becky Lynch, Lita, and um, Trish Stratus to pick up the victory, and my dad has the same. We think Damage Control sucks. We have the champions, the tag team champions, to pick up the victory, um, and win night one over. Um, we have, for the SmackDown Women's Championship, we have a change in champion. Charlotte Flair needs to go on her honeymoon, honeymoon, something like that. Take a break. And uh, we have a new champion of Rhea Ripley. I'm going to get the Elite Series 102 to uh, go. I really want that. Now that it's Judgment Day attire. And then the main event, I think, will be the Usos. Versus Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens for the undisputed WWE Championships. W not <laughs> undisputed WWE. Look at that. That's humongous. 80,000 people, I'm pretty sure. But uh, it's for the Tag Team Championships. I have the Usos to pick up the victory. And it kind of sets it up for tomorrow night's uh, main event, you know. Uh, but yeah, Usos defeat them. And it's like, okay, Bloodline still has it, you know. And then we'll get into tomorrow night's predictions in just a second. But, yes, this is my predictions. And dad, my dad also has the Usos and Rhea Ripley back there. So, yeah, 
Uh, I'm not sure about my mom, but I know she'd probably vote for Charlotte. And uh, maybe same thing as me. She loves John Cena. So, yeah. But, yeah. That's uh, night one predictions. And let me get night two ready. And get ready for WrestleMania for me and predictions. So, yeah. Let me set it up. What is going on, guys? Welcome back to a brand new... <laughs> I'm just playing. This is part two of the video. I accidentally got tripped up there. Uh, part two, night two. Uh, I think we're going to start off the show with probably the women's uh, Fatal 4-Way match. Probably. Um, it will be Raquel Rodriguez and Liv Morgan versus Ronda Rousey and Shayna Baszler versus um, Shotzi and Natalia versus uh, not Carmella. It's Chelsea Green and um, Sonya Deville. I thought it was Dewdrop for a second. Shoot, my fault uh, there. But um, in this match, I'm going to pick two people to win it. It's between the two. It's either Raquel Rodriguez and Liv Morgan, or it's Ronda Rousey, my mama's favorite, Ronda Rousey, UFC champion right there, <laughs> and Shayna Baszler. Um, let's get the women out the way. Um, but yeah, that's who I have there. Next, it will be the Raw Women's Championship match. Bianca Belair, your women's Raw Women's Champion, versus Asuka. Asuka, I see her picking up the belt. Uh, as you know, a few years ago, she lost the belt to Charlotte, and she had, like, 365-day reign, all of that. She had, like, two years down the drain with the belt, and then Charlotte came in and beat her up at the, like, I think it was WrestleMania 35. I'm not sure. It's a few years ago. But I have Asuka picking up the victory on uh, Bianca, I'm getting tired of Bianca. I know a lot of people like Bianca, and I'm probably going to get some feedback from it. But I really like Asuka. I think Asuka got it. I mean, she just needs to get a manager, because I'm sorry to say this, but I don't really understand her sometimes on the mic. But uh, obviously that's because of her accent and where she's from. But I'm not discriminating on that. I just can't understand her. Uh, whenever she's talking on the mic, and that's not her fault, obviously. Um, next, we're going to do Edge versus Finn Balor, the demon. See, this is the part that kills me. This could be Edge's retirement match, just like Rey Mysterio. It could be his retirement match, you know? But the demon, you know? Finn Balor, the demon? Like... There's not a lot of people. I don't. I think the demon's undefeated. I think, no, because he Roman beat him. Uh, but oh, uh, Edge, Edge. I love Edge. Um, I think he could win it, but I'm gonna have to go with the demon, Finn Balor of the Judgment Day. I hope it's like purple and black tomorrow, his attire. But uh, yeah, that's that. Brock Lesnar versus the Nigerian giant Omos. I have Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar is basically the underdog being thrown over the ropes the past few weeks um, on Raws and stuff. I have uh, I have Brock Lesnar being spit on by MVP, you know. Just like so much stuff that's happened to Brock, I feel like it's coming with an upset and uh, Brock gets the victory with, like, an F5, and it's like a Andre the Giant moment, as uh, MDT says, uh, where it's like, holy cow, he just picked up Hulk Ho uh, Andre the Giant, like Hulk Hogan did, you know. But, uh, yeah, that's, what I think. Uh, that's why I think Brock Lesnar will pick up the victory tomorrow night for the Intercontinental Championship. Fatal, or uh, not, uh, what is it, triple threat match. Sheamus versus Gunther. Gunther obviously is your champion right now, but I have Sheamus, Shamey boy, to pick up the victory. Uh, only title he needs, I'm pretty sure, to become a Grand Slam champion. Uh, so, yes, I think that will happen uh, there, and Sheamus becomes a Grand Slam champion. And then the main event, this is the last day I say it. It's very sad to say 
that Roman will be dethroned, but it's also very, very happy for me. I loved Roman as a champion, but um, Cody's got to win it. Or, or my teacher from school likes wrestling too, and he said a good possibility. So Jay White, Switchblade Jay White from New Japan, is a free agent right now, correct? What if he uh, Cody loses, right? Roman holds up the belts, and Roman starts attacking Cody. Uh, and the Usos come out, start attacking him. Solo comes out, start attacking him. And then we hear the bullet clubs, though. Uh, I've got a human, and I shot him with my gun. AJ Styles returns. Jay Wright debuts. The Bullet Club. Everybody comes out except for, of course, Kenny, the Bucks, um, all of them. But basically, all of the WWE uh, people come out and help Kenny because Kenny is a part of, I mean, not Kenny, Cody, because Cody is a part of the Bullet Club and attack Roman, and that sets up the Bullet Club. Club versus the Bloodline at WrestleMania Black and Lash. That's the only possibility I have with Roman Reigns winning, you know? But other than that, I have Cody Rhodes to pick up the victory and become the new Undisputed Universal Champion. Sad to see Roman go bye, bye, but somebody has to do it, and if WWE was going to do it, Cody got to do it. Cody or somebody good like Randy or somebody who comes back and, you know, beats them. But, yeah, that's what I say happens. Thank you guys so much for watching my prediction video. Um, and I hope y'all have an amazing WrestleMania night. Um, I know I will be posting some TikToks and stuff about it um, following uh, WrestleMania. And, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys later for night one um review tomorrow and also night two prediction on monday and then we'll, we'll do monday night raw but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys uh tomorrow peace out have an amazing wrestlemania weekend bye